Hello everyone. So this is what we are going to work on today. When I press on settings, I get this settings menu options and now when press when I press back, I go back to the main menu. So settings, we go to the settings page, go back, we are back in the menu page. So here we are going to use a common animated switcher, uh, a widget that comes uh, with common UI system, which allows us to easily change these menu panels and also here you can see there is some uh, animation going on here fading out and fading back with the new menu so this is also comes by default with the common UI system and I will show you how to configure that too length of the animation timing and everything and before we get started let me remind you that you can download the project files of this project and all other thousands of projects I have done in my channel from my patreon page I'll leave the link in description below. Right, now let's get started with today's episode. Okay, so this is what we have right now. We have these buttons, you know, game, chapters, extra. So it doesn't do anything right now. It's just empty buttons. So the next step is how to switch to a different menu page. For example, in here, what I want to do is when I press settings, uh, settings should appear here and also there should be a back button to go come back to this main menu. All right, so to do that, yeah, or the widgets and main menu. Yeah. And so this vertical box, this contains all the main menu items, so I'll rename this. Let's call it VB main menu. And then I'll change this into a variable because I would need to access this from the code later on. Now, if I wrap this with the common animated switcher, so here now this switcher this is same same as a widget switcher with the umgs we can switch between different widgets here okay so now let me duplicate this and i'll call it vb settings okay so now everything is same because we just duplicated this now here under settings vertical box let's rename these buttons so instead of continue i'll call it audio because it should be audio settings and then controls i'll put video because audio and video kind of goes together so then controls and maybe language also should go here. What else? Account settings. Okay, and the last one should be back button. Just a way to go back to the previous menu. And now we don't really need this extra space between these two. So this has 30. Under padding, what about this one? It's 10. So I'll make it similar. 10. Okay. Right now, see if I select this, I can see uh, options. And if I select this, I can see the main menu. Now, here, I think by default, the first one is visible. Let's see. Yeah, it's the first one. So now when I press settings, this part should disappear and the settings panel should appear. Uh, this this should be switched to the settings panel. So let's call it widget picture main menu. Should I call it WS? 
or CWS because common widget switcher. Hmm. It's called common animated switcher. Okay. So let's call it CAS. Whatever you like. All right. And this is a variable. Right. Now here for the settings. Uh, let me change these names before anything. This is continue. I call it MB because menu button. Continue. MB new game. MB chapters. MB extra. MB settings. MB quit. Okay. Now let me select the settings button and go to this on click. So here what I need to do is switch into the settings page, settings panel. So all I need to do is well all I need to do is just this get the panel, the CAS main menu and set up to widget. So as I said, I just want to go to settings. So VB settings. Now I'll promote this as a function, collapse this to function. Let's call it change panel because in case I want to do special things like maybe playing a song or just some special effect. I don't have, I have no idea at the moment. Just in case I need to do something every time that I switch the panels, then it's better to encapsulate this part inside a function. So that's why. So yeah, now when I press settings, I should go to the settings panel and also in the settings, when I press back, oh no, let me rename these buttons as well. MB hmm. MB audio MB video MB controls MB page MB account back okay uh, now in here we select the back button and on click as I said I just need to go to the main panel so select the change panel function and pass VB main menu. That should be all. Now let's see. Settings, see? Audio, video, controls, language, back. We are back in the main menu. See, it's very easy. And also, since we are using this uh, common widget switcher, co a common animated switcher, we just abruptly don't change the panel. We see some fading out and fading back so which is nice i think there are options for you to change that behavior too yeah see transition fade only we will in and out timing so there are options that's the nice thing with common uh common ui so it's well thought out you can easily change these parameters to match whatever the design you want Okay, now that's all I want to do here, but one more thing. Let me group this. This do it here. My God. This should be under settings category. Video and quick is in the main menu category so 
that is also main menu new game also main menu language and settings extra and main menu controls and settings so you get the idea okay so let me see now i have grouping so this main menu all the main menu buttons are here and all the settings buttons are here and yeah thanks for watching as always updated project file will be available for download here in the patreon page link would be in the description below and let me know if you have any questions in the comments maybe next time let's work on something like a confirmation dialog box when i press quit are you sure yes no that kind of a, a dialog box something like that see you in the next episode and goodbye